We're right back because we want to take a few minutes to introduce another important person from Caramu House. And this would be Dee Perry. And when I heard she was coming at first, and I'm going, Dee Perry is coming here <laughs> to see us, to be on our show? <laughs> never knowing, never realizing that it was Deirdre D. Perry from Caramu House. And you are the coordinator of? I'm the cultural arts and education coordinator. And I've been with Caramu for 11 years now. And what do you do as coordinator? I do the various events for the after school program, the Saturday Arts Academy, and also for um, any other you know, events that's going on with the cultural arts department. And that is all the education and training that's going on at that Caramu? That is correct. With I, all, okay, yes, go I'm ahead. I'm sorry, I recruit the, um, some of the educators to come to, um, to the various events. I go out into various schools and um, recruit students as well. And what kind of schools do you go out to to recruit? Uh, we go to Cleveland Public, all the charter schools that's in the vicinity and in our area, mm -hmm. basically, and uh, to the Warrensville Heights area as well. Okay, and so that means you do go to the Cleveland School of the Arts as part yes, of your yes, recruiting we do. Yes. Um, efforts. And do you recruit certain times of the year? Is there a special time? Or is this an all year kind of thing? It's an all year uh, event because what happens is for the various needs of the theater or for um, various plays or functions that we're doing, and we're looking for various students' um, personalities and everything, we go out throughout the year. And do you audition, I hate to say kids, but do you audition kids for uh, various purposes? Uh, yes, we do. When we have uh, various plays coming up, we do audition the students. Okay, now are there any youth plays? Now I know Richard Morris, Jr., Sometimes Michael Oatman uh, are involved in producing and directing youth-oriented plays. Anything coming up on that front anytime soon? Well, we are presently doing Deliverance, and um, we have Dominique Paramore who's directing that. And uh, what is that play about? And is it currently running? Or is yes, it it's, coming? Currently, it's currently running, mm -hmm. and it's about Henry Botts Brown, who delivered himself from the South to the North in a box. Oh, mailed himself? Mailed north. himself, <laughs> yes, to the north. Okay, now, uh, if you recall, that play, what, what are its running dates, performance dates? I think it ends at the end of uh, February. So somewhere around February 28th, 28th next week. So it would be like February, well, what is the end? Sunday. 28th is Friday. So yeah. the 29th? Would, there's no 29th this year. That's right, okay. <laughs> it goes to March 1st. We have this year, you know, yeah, year. March 1st, yes, okay. that's Sunday, yeah. yes. All right, so again, if people want to come see the play, support the youth uh, effort there at Caramu, along with the adult efforts, um, what number should they call? They should be calling 795-7070, and they can reach the bots office at 226. Extension 226. Yes. Okay, well listen, want to thank you for stopping by. You and I have just recently met each other yes. because of the Black History Month panel discussions that Caramu has been holding to help make the community more aware of, of the things that have been going on in the past hundred years at Caramu a great community organization. So thanks, Dee. And thank you. I will see you soon. Very because good. we'll be there on the 27th. Thank you. Okay, thanks for okay. stopping by. Sure. Bye now.